my god you guys so i found out about this last night but like i got two kids like i always tell you guys i got a job so you know it was just too late for me to come up on my youtube channel but i know it's out there you guys but i still want to bring it up here i cannot so chloe kardashian and um tristan thompson they really done done and not only that so hollywood unlock exposed the shit out of tristan thompson and kylie's best friend jordan woods so okay they were at a party and the everybody had their phones at first and then before jordan walks in they instruct everybody to give up their phones so since it's not something that is it's not something that's not unknown when you go to celebrity parties you usually have to give up your phone so there's no evidence of all the freaking crazy shit that goes down in there you know sex drugs all that stuff whatever so yo after they take their phones jordan woods walks in and she is reportedly according to hollywood unlocked allegedly okay i'll say allegedly because there's no proof you know what i mean but according to hollywood unlock jason lee he you know he's a savage when it comes to to these blogging streets he don't give a fuck so he called chloe kardashian himself and told himself to chloe listen my writer was inside that party and um Jordan was in there with Tristan on his lap and reportedly, allegedly, there was a kiss in there and everything. So, Jason Lee is also pissed, you guys, because I don't know if anybody else reported about this, but Jason Lee is also pissed off at TMZ because TMZ broke the news way after um, Hollywood Unlocked, by the way. And, you know, TMZ is always robbing the urban community out of everything it's always like that they always want to be first at everything so they put that they had the exclusive but it's a lie it was really jason lee that broke down with hollywood unlocked that broke down that that went and had that exclusive so because jason lee is friends with the kardashian clan okay so he went and he let them know he let chloe know what's up what's going down and he let her know before he put it on the internet for everybody to see you know that the article and you know he did his little um i think he went on instagram like i don't know he just he went and put it on hollywoodonlove.com i believe and it's everywhere so on there on the comment section chloe's best friend malika was like strong facts so she confirmed it but not only that yo so then comes chloe kardashian her damn self and puts that um barking emoji the, the person that's like has like the speaking emoji whatever she, like basically saying strong facts like confirming it that it's true that jordan woods was messing around with chloe kardashian's baby daddy now the smirk on my face you guys is because I don't know. Everybody's like, oh, poor Chloe, poor Chloe, poor Chloe. Tristan's a freaking garbage. Tristan's this, Tristan's that. Um, is anybody forgetting how Chloe Kardashian got Tristan Thompson? Which he was with somebody. Her name is Jordan, too. Go figure. What a fucking pun. No pun intended. Her name is Jordan. And she was pregnant with Tristan's baby. Even his Tristan's family was pissed off at Tristan for what he did. And he just fucking left that girl high and dry. Like, I believe she was only six months pregnant. Halfway through her pregnancy, bounced on her and started messing with Khloe Kardashian. And Khloe's always stealing these boys, man. Because she did it to freaking, she did it to, um, uh, to Trina. She did it to Trina. She did it to the girl that was dating, um whatever she's done it plenty of times so for me this is like legit karma it's pure karma nothing but karma like 
You don't do shit to people and think it's not going to come back at you. Like, straight up. So, I don't feel no sympathy for her. The only thing that I'm, I'm like, damn, it, like, damn, Tristan, like, really, it had to be her little sister's best friend. Like, bro. Like, that's the only part that I feel like, damn, that's fucked up. Because then Khloe Kardashian put up a post, and she put, you know, after seven years, you're, now, you're no longer friends, you're family. So, when family hurts you, it cuts deep. Basically, like she didn't say it word for word like that, but that's basically what she meant by it. And then she posted, um, she posted something else. I can't remember, guys, really what it was. But, anyways, she confirms it. It's true. Now, the theory is is this like legit, legit, or is this for the upcoming season of the keeping up the Kardashians? See, at first, I was thinking it's part of that. But then I started thinking deeper, and I'm like, nah. The way that she's responding to it, the way Malik is responding to it, the way that it's just coming out, it's not like some setup shit for the show. It's some real shit. And Kylie Jenner does not do good with stress. Like, she just don't. Like, that's a fact. Like, she's sewn it on the show plenty of times. So I'm just, like, thinking these bitches did it again because I kind of want to tune in. To see if, you know, there's going to be any talk between big sis and little sis. Like, yo, you going to get rid of this chick or what? Because what do y'all think? Do y'all think that Kylie Jenner is going to stop being friends with Jordan Woods? They just started a makeup line together, you guys. So now they have business together. They're not just best friends. So this is like big, you know. So it's like... She can't just drop her project with her best friend because of what the circumstances are. And the Kardashians are famous for saying there is no such thing as bad publicity. You know, um, you know the mom is going, the manager, you know, she's going everywhere. She must be getting mad happy, getting calls from everywhere, you know, doing her damage control, all the shit that she be doing. But you guys, this is a true mess and i say messy 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 jordan you messy that's fucked up like what did chloe do to you i want to hear jordan's side what y'all or do y'all want to hear jordan's side i want to hear jordan's side things like because you know the Kardashians already had their little sides coming out, you know, and her little bestie coming out and saying something. So, Jordan, speak your truth, mama. Don't be afraid to speak your truth because you know what? None of these bitches is a fucking saint. Excuse my language. None of these girls are saints. All these girls be stealing men left and right. So, hey, you basically really are family, girl. Anyways, I gotta get back to work, you know, but I will be back up in here later, and you know, we could. Anyways, put the comments down below, and I'll comment back, and we'll do a conversation about this tea. Alright, peace. Subscribe to my channel, please, loves. Please subscribe. Love y'all.